honeys and welcome to today's video. If you are new to the channel, be sure to smash the subscribe button below and hit the thumbs up because it really does help out your girl. So for today's video, we are doing part two of my sexy Halloween costume haul. And I'm really, really excited. It is already October. It is fall. It's getting colder. We get to go to the pumpkin patch, all of that good stuff. So I wanted to make a video so that you guys could kind of, kind of like help me decide what to be for Halloween. So out of all of the costumes I'm going to show you today, if you would like to see more exclusive content, be sure to head to my personal website in the description link below so you guys can see exclusive photos, videos, chat with me. I do live stream hauls, all of that good stuff that's a little too spicy for YouTube and Instagram. Um, speaking of that, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I'll be sure to put my handle on the screen so that you guys can follow me and get updates of new videos dropping, all of that good stuff. But that being said, let's get started. Let's get started on round two. If you haven't already, if you haven't already, pause this video and go see part one to my sexy Halloween costume haul so that you guys can kind of like vote and tell me what you guys think I should be for Halloween. And since I have yet to decide what to be for Halloween, you will notice that all of the tags are still on all of these bad boys um, because I'm gonna turn whatever ones I decide I don't like. So first up, super basic cheerleader costume, but this is like super sexy cheerleader costume, okay? Because first of all, super cute. Love the BBY, the baby on the front, just adorable. Second, this cutout, you guys know that I love some under boob action. <gasps> like, adorable. I just, it's such a vibe. It is such a vibe. Like, honestly, I would probably wear this as like a top. It's almost kind of like bad, like bad, like girl next door vibes. And I'm freaking here for it. Not to mention the freaking skirt that comes with this bad boy. Look at how small this is, <laughs> or short, I should say. Also, this one, I think it's because it's supposed to. This, like the like waist on this is a little bit wider because I think as opposed to it sitting like high-waisted, it's supposed to sit like a little bit low-waisted because it is so short. So that is the front, here's the back. You just have like a zipper. There is like nothing in between. So there's no shorts, no nothing. Um, but it is really cute because it shows just like the bottom of your butt cheeks. Really freaking cute, super sexy if you're feeling like really, really bold. Okay, next up, another kind of like basic Halloween costume is schoolgirl Halloween costume. Okay, but I'm here for it. I've actually never been a schoolgirl for Halloween. So I figured why not? So number one, love the plaid skirt, okay? It's a vibe, I'm totally here for it. This skirt is obviously like way longer and has more coverage. So this one is meant to be high-waisted. Here is the back, just the zipper. But as you can kind of tell, like it has this like V shape to it, which is super flattering because it'll like come up on your hips and then V kind of down to like your midriff. Really, really flattering. And this is the top here, so just short sleeve. And it has this like open front with these two ties. So you just like tie it together. I wore just like a cute lacy bra under it because it is just like completely open. So you definitely have to wear like a bra or bralette under it for sure. It also came with some suspenders, which your girl freaking loves, adorable, totally adding to the vibe and some really cute glasses. I also think that this Costume would be really cute if you put your hair up in like a high ponytail. I actually wish I did that now that I'm thinking about it. Um, it would also probably be really cute with some like fishnets and like high socks um, just to kind of like totally add to the schoolgirl vibe. All right, honeys, we are going to take a brief intermission in today's video because I want to share with you guys the Miss Peachy IPL hair removal device that I have been using for the past couple of weeks now. It is extremely cost effective compared to other brands on the market. It is only and it's extremely environmentally friendly because over 2 billion plastic razors end up in a landfill every year. Now, one really unique thing about this product in particular is that it has unlimited flashes. 
And you're probably like, Tiana, what does that mean? Well, every time that you hit the button and it makes its little flash to help remove your hair, um, there are no limit to the amount of times you can basically click this button. A lot of other brands out there have like a 500,000 flash limit, meaning you can only hit this 500,000 times and then there's no more flashes left, so the product will no longer work. Um, but this Miss Peachy one does have unlimited flashes. So this is the device here, and it comes with this really cute little bag to help protect the device as well. But you just plug it in here and hold down the power button. There we go, you can hear her start. And depending on your hair color and your skin tone, um, which the manual right here will actually help you figure out, there's a chart so that you know which level to be on. I go to level three, so let's see if we can see it on camera. But you'll start to see these dots. So there's one dot, then two dots. I keep mine on level three. That's just the proper level for my hair and my skin tone. And then when you want to go ahead and start your treatment, first things first, super important, you guys, it comes with these glasses. Like, first of all, how cute and trendy. They're not those like, you know, awful tanning glasses. So you do have to put your glasses on, super important. You have to protect your eyes from the light. But when you are ready to go, there is just the little light button here that you click and you can start your hair removal journey. See that? See the light? You can probably hear it too, there we go. So I started using this product a couple of weeks ago. I can already tell a difference. Um, the main points I have started are on my arms and my legs, but it's awesome. I mean, it's a super cost-effective at-home solution. It does not hurt whatsoever. I cannot stress that enough. I promise you, it does not. You saw me just do it on camera, but I did want to kind of point out the proper way to use it so that you get the best and most results from the product. So first and foremost, you have to shave the area that you want to treat. So whatever area you want to treat, make sure that you are cleanly shaven because the point of this device is to penetrate the hair follicle to help slow the growth of your hair and eventually have no growth. Second is to plug the device in here like I showed you guys earlier and place the device on your skin, ensuring full contact here. So no space in between, nothing like that. You want it directly on your skin. Then, as I showed you before, you just turn this bad boy on, select the level of treatment that you want. And of course, most importantly, before you start treatment, you have to put on your super cute, super sassy protective eyewear glasses. And last but not least, after you are done treating your area, apply moisturizer or cooling gel to get the most out of your results. Now I will put the link to the product in the video description below so that you guys can check them out. Let's get back to today's video. Okay, up next we have like Fred Flintstone vibes, except like his wife, and I can't remember what her name is but we have this cute like white little number. It's also, I don't know if you guys can like see the fabric, but it's like really, really soft. Um, so super cute top. It like ties up here with this like brown string and then has the really cute like, you know, like point cutouts at the bottom. And it does have the matching bottoms that go with this. So it's this really, really cute skirt adorable love her again with, with the brown like matching tie string here now what i love about this one too is it's like has like like this like shy of sexiness if that makes any sense so like right here like this is still like all completely open so you can show a lot of like leg and hip and like a little bit of booty but it does come with matching like underwear bottoms to wear under it so these are like kind of supposed to show and it is the same like super soft like velvety fabric too and it comes with this really cute like matching necklace that she wears in the cartoon and last but not least, I also got a little like cosplay with this as well. And your girl got the matching wig. Like, oh, how fun! 
Stop it. I'm obsessed. I am absolutely obsessed. And honestly, like they're not like uncomfortable at all, which I'm like actually super surprised about. Super easy to like put on and like fit to your head. This is like the inside, what it looks like. It's just like a net, but I don't know. It was like super fun. Okay, next up we have a nurse's costume, but I am obsessed with this one, okay? I've never seen a nurse's costume quite like this. So I'm gonna show you guys all the pieces, but first, is like the top here just like a bralette top okay and then the bottom oh super cute i'm obsessed this is the bottom there is like a little bit more coverage on the back so it's not exactly a thong but then it has the like strings here so that you can hook fishnets so it'd be really cute if you hooked up like red fishnets to it with like some red heels or something like that but but this is like the nurse like cover it's like completely see-through. It's like a nurse jacket, but it's totally see-through. I'm obsessed. I think this is so hot. Like usually the nurse's costumes, it's just like, it's like a white cover up. It's like a white gown and you can't see under it. But I love that you basically just wear like a bra and the like garter undie slash belt thing underneath it and you see through. I just, I've never seen anything like it and I'm absolutely obsessed. Not to mention all of the accessories that come with it. You have the adorable like nurse hat. Oh my God, a vibe. I'm so here for it. And then red gloves, super sexy. And last but not least, you have like a stethoscope. I do have to say this is like super freaking cheap. When I was like filming it, this totally like fell off, but you just put it back on. It's fine. We don't really need to like listen to people's like heartbeats. It's fine. And you have these cute little like cuffs that go on like your wrists to match. Super cute. Okay, so last up, we have like a really sexy like mummy costume, kind of like a bodysuit, but it's like a couple different pieces. So first up, you have the top. That's really cute and like holy. It's basically just like a type of fishnet. Um, but, and then it has this like cutout sleeve. But what I do also really like about this costume is that it gives you all of the like undergarments to go with it. So this is just like the bandeau that goes under that. So it's not like completely see-through obviously. Um, and then you have like the bottoms that go with it. And this is kind of like a two part bottom. So again, love how it comes with the like bottoms and then attached to it is like one leg. So this like goes on your thigh and then it goes like all the way down your leg. Then it obviously comes with like the other leg that is not attached. But what I also like to help it stay up is it has this like gel, I don't know, like line right here to kind of like stick to your skin to help stay up. And this like really cute mini skirt that goes over like that bottom piece that I just showed you, which again has that like gel piece to help just like stay in place on your body. And last but not least, they basically just took like that same fabric and cut it for you so that you could do like a super cute little like headband action. So yeah, that is all that I have for you guys. Those are my last five costumes that I wanted to share with you. So let me know what you guys think. Comment below what you think I should be for Halloween. Like I said, if you would like to see any more content, in all of these costumes, be sure to head to the link in the description below so that you can subscribe for all of the good stuff. And I will see you honeys in the next video. Mwah!